10, your eye on West Texas. Now I hear all the bushes and it got me. A six-year-old boy is recovering after a mountain lion attack at Big Bend National Park. What started as a family vacation quickly took a turn for the worst. CBS 7 Shannon Murray sat down with a family who is still in shock after this horrific attack. Shannon? We're on a trail or uh, down in the woods or anything. We were on a sidewalk between a restaurant and a hotel. The Hobbs family drove in from Austin, hoping to enjoy the outdoors in Big Bend National Park. But their vacation was cut short. It slipped up on them. After a mountain lion attacked six year old Rivers just feet from the Chisos Mountain Lodge where they were staying. And, and had a hold of his face. And the, so the cat was clamped on his face. Reached down and got my pocket knife out and uh, stabbed the cat in the, in the chest and it let go at that point. The family immediately took action, but they claimed the lodge did just the opposite. They made a decision right there in front of me that they were not going to make an announcement to all the guests that there was a mountain lion attack outside and that the animal was still at large. And despite the gruesome stitches from his surgery, Rivers claims he didn't cry once. Did it hurt? No, no, not, not, not that bad. And we're, we're lucky that he's going to get away with some scars and it didn't take his eye or to get his neck or anything. Shannon Murray, CBS 7 News. Shannon, thanks. David Elkowitz with the Big Bend National Park tells CBS 7 this was actually the second attack of the day in the same area. He also said the mountain lion tried to attack another family but was fended off by a backpack. Now both families have also told CBS 7 the mountain lion looks small, young and in bad shape. Park rangers have begun evacuating trails and campsites near that area earlier today. Those closed areas include the Chisos Basin, Window Trail, the Pinnacles, Boulder Meadow, and Juniper Flats.